Look at that ugly thing. Anyway, hello. So we are well, well, well overdue an update. So the, the, my plans have changed that much since this lockdown. It's unbelievable. So we'll start off with the Defender. So here it is. Here's the axle. Come on. There we go, look. So I have started rubbing down the axle and it is the current project after one little thing that we'll come to in a minute. So that is what's going off at the minute. The Defender is on the list because it needs to be done and it's annoying me because I can't get round to it some days. The plans with Big Jim have changed. So I originally fitted the engine because I got a month's warranty on it. But, well, the, the plan was fit the engine, I know it needed a little bit of welding on the back end, get that done, take it for test and I had my tow bar back so I could put parts in the trailer or do whatever I needed to do because I use a tow bar a lot. That went wrong drastically. The reason for that is, I don't know if you can see because I've not turned the light on in the garage but in fact that's a good side. I do see this. yeah i knew it needed a little bit of welding and i've had it welded up quite a lot but it is completely beyond repair to weld it properly it's just yeah beyond it so i've actually bought a back end off a of suzuki and after the land rover's done the back end is going to get fitted to that and then that's then roadworthy enough because at the minute it's just completely rotten. The body, the bodies on the gymnies are terrible for rot. So that's been put on hold. The black Freelander is pretty much ready for the scrapyard. I've just got the interior to get rid of, so I'm just waiting for somebody to offer me what I want for that. Uh, it, it is on eBay and Facebook if any Freelander fans I want in a little bit. It's literally it's, everything's getting sold off really, really cheap just to get shut of it and to help anybody out who needs any bits. So have a look. I've just put it as a Freelander TD4 breaking for spares. Uh, that's where I am at the minute. Now, because obviously of what I do, um, and the defender's been off the road for that long, I do buy cheap runarounds just to literally just get to work and back and do the daily chores of life. Um, now. Obviously because I work on cars and I know quite a bit about them, people ring me up and ask if I've got any cheap runarounds for sale. Or they'll see what I'm driving around, if they like it, usually people want it straight away. So this brings me, I'm just trying to shield from the wind, to this Freelander 2. Yeah, I bought it, I bought it. Spares, well it was a non-runner. Uh, somebody was begging me for my little Peugeot that I was running about in. This come up, non-runner, I thought, I'm going to have a look at that. Got it for a good price, and the Peugeot sold straight away. So this won't take much to get running because obviously I've had a look, I found out what's wrong with it, and it needs a drive shaft. So the, the owner was running it with no drive shaft at all. So it was three wheel drive. I don't know how he's been driving it, to be honest. But for the bore I've got it for, I'm more than happy. But the main thing that I wanted it is because of this. Yes. I've got a tow bar back. So, yeah, I just thought I'd give everybody a bit of an update. I am on with the Defender. I've bought a Freelander 2. I don't know what I'm going to do in regards of doing any videos on it as yet. Now I have got to service it, uh, there's a couple of things that need doing so obviously this is going to be, the front again, this is going to be the daily run around for me at the minute. So I'll just give you a quick quick tour, I can hear all the Defender people going, oh, Freelander, Freelander, but they're not bad actually. So it's the excess spec, the leather interior, it's the 2.2 TD4, and yeah, so that's the, this is the new daily run around. Quick update for everybody, but the Defender is back, the, the, <laughs> it is next on the list and I am currently on with that. 
but because somebody was begging me for the Peugeot, I let it go, and I obviously I've got that as well. So that's just a bit of an update for everybody. Obviously, the Jimny is going to be on hold now. The the black Freelander one's going to the scrapyard soon, hopefully next week. Um, back on the Defender, I've started needle needle gunning the chassis down, and everything's solid. That back cross member, it is solid. So I'm really <laughs> Yeah, thank goodness for that. So a bit of an update for everybody. So keep your eye on the channel because there is more Defender videos coming soon. I'll see you later.